I've been in the real estate game for 30 years. This is just video introduction because I, I have cerebral palsy. I am not drunk or on drugs. I know all about real estate, so I wanted to put this out there. Help, uh, this is Ben on my uh, other camera. Um, let's talk about when you should maybe start, to, you know, calling your um, leaves. Wholesaler, sellers, whatever. You, I call them leaves. To get on the phone, you know. You know, for five minutes. One more thing. If you take more than ten minutes on the phone, it's a wasted time. It, it's, um, it's, um, you know, time is money. So, more than fifteen, let's say fifteen minutes for a lead. And you you're just wasting your time. Anyway, to get back to the subject. I take off Monday and Tuesday and start you know, calling these people Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Um in the mornings no. No, may, maybe I, I would start about 11 o'clock in the morning before lunch. But usually what I do is I call these potential uh, leads for my wholesale selling uh, housing uh, business about 1 o'clock in the afternoon to maybe six at night, so that's five hours of call time, about, so 15 minutes, uh, that's four calls an hour, that's about 20 calls a day, some people think, think uh, you should call about a hundred calls a day, which I used to do just to say hi. You know, you know, uh, you can call, uh, you can do that too. I, you know, I, you know, that's just to say hi, um, uh, investor, I buy houses. What do you like to? sell your house, can we talk, can I call you later, you know, uh, you're friends with them, you know, best buddies, uh, see, at, in the morning, no one wants to talk in the morning, let them have lunch, let them have, you know, breakfast, lunch, you know, call them before dinner, you know, maybe call call a couple people uh, until eight, eight, nine at night. <laughs> Don't call people at, you know, 10, 11 at night, you know, uh, if they're sleeping. <laughs> you know, now if you're calling from the East Coast to the West Coast, yes, you can, you know, do... You know, you can basically call until midnight on the West Coast. But, uh, like I said, these people don't want to be bothered. Yes, you're running a business. Yes, you want the deal. Yes, you want the wholesale deal. But, I mean, I, I, I assume... I see newbies do this all the time. They would call the people, take a half hour, and, you know, I would 
just introduce myself for five minutes. Say, hi, I'm a uh, local investor. Or I'm a, a real estate investor. I, I, are you interested in selling your home? If so, can we talk? If not, you know, can I call you back? Think about it. Click. Next to call. Do the same thing. Click. Same thing. They'll, they said, yes, we can talk about it. And then you go through the uh, process. You know, you question now how many, uh, you know, how much damage is in the house, uh, any fix up, any this, any that. How much do you feel like you can, uh, how much do you want for it? You know, don't ever, don't ever say any pricing, um, because, um, I did that a couple of times when I started years ago and, you know, dealers went through, you know, the dealers went, Ugh. uh, because, you know, you had to go back and tell them, uh, can we lower the price? Can we do this? Can we do that? Can I have more time? You know, back then, I, we didn't have computers, the, the internet. So, you know, so, uh, but, you know, like I said, don't push these people. Um, you know, I mean, it, you know, a hundred calls a day, you, you can do it. I mean, uh, you know, it's cold. It's all n the numbers game, you know. Um, I call, you know, in between that, I call new real estate brokers. I mean, real estate brokers are, are a dime a dozen. So, uh, but, uh, you know, you rely on the real estate brokers. I mean, if, if, the, you know, if you're dealing with a $3 million house in a $3 million neighborhood and you can get a deal for a million dollars, I mean, if, that, if that's sixty, if that's $30,000 on, you know, their back end, you know, for the real room. So he, he or she don't care, you know, you know for the big stuff. You know, rely on your real estate brokers for the big stuff, like uh, half a million to a million. I mean, uh, you know, I, I do that all the time because, like, you know, if they, if, you know, if the house is worth $3 million on the water, and say in Palm Beach, uh, North Palm Beach, and, you know, I can get the house for, you know, uh, half that, you know, uh, a million and a half, and put, put, uh, you know, three hundred, four hundred thousand dollars into the house, uh, or I can, um, get the property for a half million, a million dollars, knock down the house, and build new for, you know, half a million dollars, you know, you know, uh, $750,000, you know, a mansion, you know, a good size house, you know, you can do that, you know, well, let the other guy do it, uh, you know, uh, the guy who's going to buy the house for, for, uh, you know, a million and two million too. Um, you know, um, I'm just saying that, you know, the big, the big, the big guys, the big, the big, um, so get, I'm always off the track, but, uh, the thing is, uh, I would never call anyone Monday, Tuesday, because they're going back to work, 
you know, the job sucks. Most jobs sucks. They, they don't, the, so Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, you know, if they, you know, might want to talk to you. So, you know, um, so think about that. Uh, so, um, it's about red, I think. Um, see you guys later.